Have you guys ever had to ride in an ambulance? No. Yeah, I did. Like in Japan, actually. In Japan, yeah, because oh, okay. like Aki's like Aki had a like slight accident right. at our last place, and uh, like it, it was pretty bad. So like we had to call the hospital, and I was riding the hospital, uh, riding the hospital, riding, riding the, the hospital. <laughs> <laughs> I had to get an ambulance. So right. I was, so I was riding the ambulance late at night, and like because it was late at night, the closest hospital was closed. Right, which makes no fucking sense. Like you'd think hospitals are open all the time. Yeah. Uh, so we had to go to like the next furthest one. So it was like a 15, 20 minute ride. Yeah. Um, and uh, luckily, you know, like Aki was okay. Like she was calming down in the ambulance. Right. And uh, it was so fucked up because it's like in my head during that whole ambulance ride, like 95% of my brain was like, oh God, I hope, you know, Aki's okay. And she'll, yeah. you know, we'll be able to mm-hmm. get out of this yeah, fight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And 5% of my brain was like, oh fuck, you're, I'm in an ambulance. <laughs> <laughs> like, like, whoa, this is so cool. I've never been in one before. This is what it looks like? Oh shit. <laughs> I, I always just feel really bad. I feel like I'm inconveniencing these workers. Yeah, even though even though it's their job. It their job yeah. yeah, like I could, I could my, my leg could be broken. I'm like, oh fuck, I'm so sorry for wasting your time. Yeah. Like, surely if someone else has a heart attack or something, you can yeah. go to. Like, I'm, I'm sorry, I can get that myself, it's all right. I'll just call an Uber. Yeah. <laughs> just, just call an Uber, right? It was just like when, uh, I remember I was in the emergency room. I've never been in the ambulance, by the way, but I was in the emergency room and this guy was just holding onto his thumb. And I thought that was really fucking weird. Ooh. And he was really calm. Yeah. He's just holding onto his thumb like this, and his, I could see that- He's holding onto his thumb. Like his, his thumb, thumb was falling off? His thumb had been cut off, and he was holding onto- Oh, it. like in his hand. He was holding oh. onto his thumb. What? And he was <laughs> like really calm, and they were talking to him, being like, are you ready, Mr. Jones, to go to the- Yeah, it's, and he was like, yeah, yeah, it's all right, we can go. I don't mind waiting a little bit. It's really weird. <laughs> it was really strange. Because I didn't realize what he was doing at first until I like saw the bag of ice with it, and yeah. then he had a Band-Aid going around like this, and his hand was like, like this, right? Like. And he had like bandage going around. Oh. I just, I just wanted him to be like, "Are you ready, Mr. Jones?" And be like, "Thumbs up, haha." <laughs> <laughs> it's really weird. I, I've, you know, I was like TV shows in the UK, like like just farmers who like had their arm like cut off, yeah. and they're like, "Yeah, whatever, we'll be ready." <laughs> yeah. Dude, I'd be fucking freaking out. Cause, cause like if there's one finger you don't want to lose. You don't want to, you don't want to do right. You don't yeah. want to freak out. You want to be yeah, calm. That's, that's mm. true. And I feel like that's the more true. you panic, the the worse it is for everyone. Yeah, so you have yeah, to like calm course. yourself down, but I don't know. It's easier said than done. Right? Yeah, I mean, obviously, <laughs> I, we've never, I've never been in that situation, so it's hard to like imagine how you'd react in that situation because you've kind of never been in that situation. Yeah, I, it's weird, really, because when I've been in situations where I, f- I, I f- feel like I have to calm myself down, I, afterwards I'm like, is that what you know? You see people like freaking out. Yeah. Are, are they like trying to calm themselves down, or like what's going through their head? Is it just like what do you mean? Like when, when, when I'm like, let's say like. Uh, if I'm bleeding really badly, which has happened a few times mm. or something, and I have hemophilia, mm. and my, my my whole focus when I when it's happened, I remember distinctly is like I'm literally just focusing on not freaking out. Yeah. That's all oh, I'm yeah, doing, yeah, right. yeah, yeah. and I'm like I'm like trying to keep it together. Yeah, and I just think like I'm like, is that what everyone does? I don't know because there's no way to get in someone else's mind. Right? No, mm. yeah. so I wonder like. When some has, has anything ever happened to you where you're like really scared and you're like freaking out? Probably like, n- like I've never had anything like life threatening or anything yeah. like that, so yeah. I, I wouldn't know myself how I would react. But if it's if if I know how I react with a lot of situations, it's just yeah, calm. <laughs> yeah, calm. yeah, it's you like know? trying to force yourself. I don't know how to. I don't know how the the human mind is really fucking weird. I don't, yeah, I don't know. like I'm like I I'm the kind of guy who in stressful situations just say nothing. Like, I don't know, like, yeah. like yeah. I, I don't, okay, this is going off tangent now, but like, I don't, I don't physically react when like someone tries to, tries to jump scare me a lot of the times, right? I, I remember, I remember like every time there's a jump scare or anytime Sydney like tries to like prank jump scare me, like I like, she goes, ah, like that or something when I come out of the shower or whatever. Yeah. And I'm, and I'm just like, completely like fucking the Terminator zero reaction. And she's just like, fuck you. And I'm like, haha, Sydney, that's right. I ain't a pussy bitch. Whereas, in- <laughs> whereas inside, I'm just like, fuck my life. You know, it's like, like in- inside I'm like screaming my fucking heart out, man. So like, I, I don't know, like- he slowly <laughs> runs down your leg. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, get good, Sydney. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yeah, so I don't know. I am, like- the, I am the complete opposite. Like I hate it when someone comes around the corner and like scares me. Like I always stop myself from like throwing a fist out. Cause I'm like, it's a threat. Oh no, it's not, it's not. Okay, thank God. It's a threat. <laughs> My final flight is just like fight. No, 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 okay. I shouldn't, I shouldn't. No, but like, but it's weird because when I had to call the ambulance for Aki, mm-hmm. I was like surprisingly calm. I thought I was gonna be, cause I'd never like called the ambulance before, right? Or like, yeah. you know, cause I didn't know what the fuck the procedure was, right? So the yeah. first time I was calling, I was in my head, I was like, oh God, what the fuck am I gonna say? Am I gonna stutter? You know, what the hell's gonna happen? <laughs> but then by the time I got finished, I was like, oh, 
That I was a lot calmer than I thought yeah, I was. Yeah, Domino's be. will be here in 15 minutes, honey. Don't worry about it. I'm going to call the ambulance now. Oh, yeah. shit. Yeah. <laughs> oh, <fuck>. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh, you said ambulance. Oh, oh shit. I thought you said pepperoni. Okay. Like, don't, don't worry, Aki. The double pepperoni pizza is yeah. going to be here in 15 <laughs> minutes. Yeah, oh, something, yeah, oh, something to look forward to. Don't worry. <laughs> fuck. <laughs> fuck. <laughs> Who's going to get here faster? The Domino's or the or the ambulance? My bet's on the Domino's. <laughs> 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 yeah, no, it was it was surprisingly calming. But then I think it was for me. I'm calm in the moment, but then when it's all over, that's yeah. when it all comes out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. So, so like, to me, I panic like post when everything just kind of sinks in to be like, mm. holy shit, that fucking happened, and yeah, I yeah, went yeah. through all this shit. And it's only after the event has transpired that it actually starts to sink in, and uh, I start to feel the gravity of everything that's happened. Yeah, yeah, yeah. At least to me.